ನಿತ್ಯಂದೇಶ್ವರ ಪರಮಶಿವ ಸಂಭ ನಿತ್ಯಂದೇಶ್ವರಿ ಪರಾಶಕ್ತಿ ಮಧ್ಯಮ ಅಸ್ಮದಾಚಾರ್ಯಪರ್ಯಂತ ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರ I welcome you all with my love and respects. I welcome all the devotees, disciples, samajis, satsangis, shri mahans, mahans, tanedar, kotaris, visitors, viewers sitting with us all over the world through Nityananda TV, two-way video conferencing, having Naina Diksha. I welcome all of you with my love and respects. I'll expand on second and third verse of Nityananda Jnana Baddhadi, the ultimate compilation from the revealed scriptures of Hinduism, Vedas and Agamas. Tatsarvam gata yishyami yoga yuktya shrunu priye yatsvarupam nijam suddham vyabakam sarvato mukham ಸರ್ವೂದಾಂತರಾವಸ್ಥಂ ಸರ್ವಪ್ರಾಣಿಷು ಜೀವನ ಯೋಗಗಮ್ಯಂ ದುರಾಸಾದ ದುಷ್ಪ್ರಾಪಂ ಕೃತಾದಂಬಿ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ದ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸ್ಲೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟೂ ವರ್ಸ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಸ್ಪೀಕ್ about all that listen dear established in yoga the uniting space of oneness with me its real form and nature is without origin pure pervading pervading all and having faces everywhere it is existing within all living creatures and present in the hearts of all things attained by yoga difficult to accomplish hard to attain for all beings you should know very clearly when mahadeva paramashiva says he exists in all beings but he is not attained by all beings very important understanding you need to have understand your actions does not define you your cognitions define you he may be in you but you will not be in him if you think only your actions define you you he may not be in you but you please listen he may be in you but you will not be in him if you don't have violence inside if your cognition is let's all coexist even your ferociousness will be so useful for humanity like mahadeva's ferociousness if you have the cunning strategy violence based even your charity will be cheating i tell you most of the time charity is cheating 
in a very low level charities for name and fame little next level the charity is to get some punya good karma merit for other world in the next level charity is a very cunning cheating strategy to keep the concept of money alive understand if the poor know they are never going to get money anyway they are not going to run after it to keep the value of the currency you need to circulate it and you cannot make them realize that currency has no value then it's almost like a you ended up in marriage where suddenly you realize all your love romance everything has disappeared understand neither you can be made to realize currency has no value nor you can feel you can never get currency constantly the carrot need to be dangled in front of your eyes charity is used many time to dangle the carrot with violence even charity is cheating if your cognition is violence even charity is cheating if your cognition is let's all coexist what you believe as your core value you if that is based on let's all coexist happily beautifully then even your so called anger will just be ferociousness it will not do bad to humanity it will do only good to humanity it will do good to you and good to humanity cognitions matter then the action that is why mahadeva says i may exist in you but you may not exist in me till you look up to your source it's like a indian parents the best place to keep the money hidden is the kids school notebooks which they never touch the best way to hide for the god is inside your consciousness which you never enter he is hiding right above your nose anya third eye i don't want to say right under your nose right above your nose the place you never seek the place you never look for he is sitting right inside you and you have a great delusion called i don't know how to look inside me what you think as you hold that with will persistence that is what is the technique to look inside you what you feel as you you perceive as you go on be holding it holding it you will see many layers dissolve disappear core the whole hold the core you your perception about you your understanding about you your idea about you your feeling about you understand when you try to catch 
your core of what you feel about you your existence gets focused towards the source one of the biggest strength i had is that bliss bliss based decision to coexist happily because of that non violence has become the very breathing maximum i'll say let them not harass me that soul is the highest level of expression of enmity is only that much from me let there not be any problem from them that's all i have felt some people should not be near me they should not harass me but never felt or cursed somebody should be destroyed i always felt if some destruction need to be done let kalabairava decide he is alive it's not that is non existence he is existing he exists from the age of 5 6 i have seen this 11 rudras always walking around me protecting me not as a imagination ahim the let me become many to celebrate me egoham bahushyamaha you will see all around you you continuously like a magnet attract joy bliss non violence more and more and more higher cognitions i tell you even if violence and negativity is thrown at you it will not affect you you will live as parama shiva mahadeva nothing will touch you you will continue to reside in the space of parama shiva the core cognitions of you core values of you core perceptions of you what gives you respect on you about you technical glitch what gives respect for you on you to score value score perception core truths core concept core cognition if those core cognitions can be turned towards the source powerful cognitions see when parama shiva reflects on you in the brain he reflects us 
ज्ञान बाधा पवर्फु काग्निशंस इन दाडी रिफ्लेक्ट योग बाधा ये योगिक अलइनमेंट टूवर्ड्स द सोर्स इन द लाइफ स्टाइल ही एक्सप्रेस मैनिफेस्ट चरिया पाधा the powerful lifestyle in your emotion he expresses as kriya pada feeling connection with the source the powerful cognitions are jnana pada powerful feelings are kriya pada powerful body is yoga pada powerful lifestyle is charya pada Paramashiva expresses as this four in your life for you to focus on him. When you focus on him, this four expresses. When you express this four, you focus on him. Manifesting this four is Charya Pada. Kriya Pada. ज्ञान पाद योग पाद मैनिफेस्टिंग दिस फोर इज वन कबड़ी आस्ट मी गुरुकुल के स्वामीजी ई फील वट इज द डिफर बिटवी बीइंग वट इज द डिफर बिटवी बीइंग इन दिस गुरुकुल एंड आउट सैड स्कूल ई वॉन्ट टू नो ई टोल फस्ट डिफर सिंपल डिफर फूड द आर्गानिक हेल्दी फूड यू गेट a challenge you will not get anywhere even if you are paying million dollar per year and studying you will not be able to get this food as per paramashiva's instruction food at this age where you are building your muscles and body thought currents which is building black for your very being at this age you will never get anywhere else other than my gurukul my gurukul is not my business it is my being it is literally i open my very personality what i had from arunagiri yogeshwara i am trying to give it to the next generation that is my gurukul my integrity to arunagiri yogeshwara is my gurukul my gratitude to arunagiri yogeshwara is my gurukul yes outside you will get great pizza i don't need to translate it pizza yes you make it various food you don't understand along with that food you get all the diseases side effects after effects which is supposed to come to you so that you can continue to buy medicines and be caught in that grid the unholy nexus of food industry and pharmaceutical industry you will be just a prey don't think when you eat non organic food you are eating you are eaten the great lifestyle of paramashiva you will never get other than inside my adinams and gurukuls understand it's not pride as on now on the planet earth if i scan with vedagami consciousness whether it is charya pada means lifestyle level or kriya pada 
feeling connection rituals or yoga pada aligning your body to the paramashiva or jnana pada powerful cognitions to the paramashiva i can very comfortably say with all my integrity my gurukul and adinams are the best place yes i am going to make it bestest bestest as bestest but as on now this is the best try with all your money with all your infrastructure with all your facilities outside try to get regular meal of my gurukul standard pure organic vegetarian real food most of the richest cities in the world are food deserts means there is nothing to eat food like products are available not food is available same way every day the kind of cognitions ideas get strengthened in you is very important because that is the building block of you it's like brick with which building is built each cognition getting strengthened in you is a brick is a block with which the building is getting built gurukul an adinam is the best place where you are at least reminded every day about the higher cognitions somebody was told that kailash is fully golden and this guy goes and he sees really everything is golden one corner doesn't look like golden he says oh that corner is not golden if that is not golden if everything is not golden what is the use of being in kailash outside is also same let me go back go <laughs> logic lad Chickly cheats you. You feel zero percent golden is much better than ninety-nine percent golden. Actually, even Kailash is complete. I know Kailash is hundred percent golden. Your perception it looks ninety-nine percent golden and one percent is not golden. so you feel no, no 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 then better to be outside okay i am telling you whether you know it or not the way you are built in kailash every day with the charya pada kriya pada yoga pada jnana pada and the whole atmosphere vatavarana created is unimaginable unimaginable anything is worth sacrificing to be in gurukul to be in our adinam in every level again and again and again one big group is working towards completion to achieve the state space and powers of paramashiva a big gang is working towards the state space and powers of paramashiva understand continuously 
raise yourself to be one with parama shiva continuously work on manifesting parama shiva continuously align yourself to parama shiva every meal in the kailasa is blessed only if you are blessed you will be able to have it it's not joke to partake the offered food it is not joke to live in the boundaries of kailasa it's not joke i tell you nothing can equate to living the lifestyle of parama shiva yoga parama shiva powerful cognitions of parama shiva worshiping revering parama shiva i wanted all of you to contemplate on this great truth how to align your life more and more into lifestyle of powerfulness action style of powerfulness thinking style of powerfulness cognitions of powerfulness lifestyle of powerfulness is charya apada creative style of powerfulness is kriya apada body of powerfulness is yoga apada powerful cognitions is jnana apada contemplate on this truth i lead you to the deeper space of oneness i lead you into the oneness of parama shiva into the space of oneness of parama shiva sit straight close your eyes chant the mahavakya intensely inside your inner space om nityananda parama shivoham om nityananda parama shivoham ಪರಮಶಿವೋಹಂ ಓಂ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಪರಮಶಿವೋಹಂ ಯತ್ಸ್ವೂಪ ನಿಜ ಶುದ್ಧ ವ್ಯಾಪಕಂ ಸರ್ವೋಮುಖ ೂತಾಂತರಸ್ತ್ರಾಣಿಷು ಜೀವನ ಯೋಹಗಮ್ಯ ದುರಾಸಾದ ದುಷ್ಪ್ರಾಪಂ ಕೃತಿ
ಸರ್ವಭೂತಾಂತರಾವಸ್ಥಿಷು ಜೀವನ ಆಸ್ ಪರಮ ಶಿವ ಐ ಎಕ್ಸಿಸ್ಟ್ ವಿತ್ ಇನ್ ಆಲ್ ಲಿವಿಂಗ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಚರ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರಸಂಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ಆಲ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ my real form is pure pervading all having faces everywhere let parama shiva manifest in all the beings in the form of oneness let parama shiva manifest all the states space powers of parama shiva let him manifest to us let parama shivas power of all pervasiveness manifest in all of us let our senses perceive everything let the powers of remote vision remote hearing remote perception remote touching remote taste remote feeling manifest in all of us let the powers of remote seeing remote hearing remote smelling remote tasting remote touching remote feeling all manifest in all of us let all pers- pervasiveness manifest in all of us
let state, space and powers of Paramashiva manifest in all of us. Paramashivoham. I bless you all. Let's all radiate with integrity, authenticity, responsibility, enriching, causing, living Shuddhat Vaita Saivam. Paramashivoham. The eternal bliss. Nityananda. Thank you. Be blissful.